you might want to uh, change a horizontal word into a vertical word and the steps are listed. Uh, first copy the word, uh, go to your new location, uh, press the shift key and it's mandatory that you click edit and paste picture. Uh, then you click your right mouse button on the picture and select the picture toolbar. That allows you to rotate the image until it's the way you want it. Then you can save your spreadsheet. Uh, you can do this for as many words as you want to. So let's start with piano. Okay, I'll click my right mouse button. I'll copy piano. I'll go to the location where I want to paste it vertically and I hold my shift key down while I click edit and it right there it says paste picture. So now it, of course it's not vertical because um, um, anyway I haven't rotated my picture yet but if I click my right mouse button this toolbar appears and I can click this little icon to rotate my image to the left, to the left, to the left. And now if that's the way I want it facing down, I can drag these little circles larger to the left and to the right until, until it fits uh, the way I want it to. And um, yeah, anyway, let's get the toolbar out of the way and we'll do one more example. This time I'll type T-O-M, but Tom is not centered and it won't be centered when I paste it uh, vertically. So I highlight Tom and I click Format, Cells, and I choose Alignment instead of Number. I choose Alignment, and then I have a horizontal alignment. So I click the down arrow and select Center. Then I click the vertical down arrow and select Center. Then I click OK, and Tom is nicely centered. So I click my right mouse button to copy Tom, go to my new location, and I hold the shift key down as it says in step three, and I must click edit. Uh, the right mouse button doesn't work, so you must click edit and paste picture. So Tom is fine, and luckily my toolbar is still on the screen. Otherwise I would have to click my right mouse button on Tom and it says uh, show the picture toolbar. Um, be nice if it would stay there all the time until I want to get rid of it. But say I get rid of it then I click my right mouse button. Right there it says show the picture toolbar. But yeah if you're lucky, it'll be on the screen and not way off to the left or right. So, but you can drag it around to wherever you want it and do a little rotating with the rotate 90 degrees left, 90 degrees left, 90 degrees left. And then you'll probably want it a little bigger. But notice all this extra space in there. That's because I had all this extra space to begin with and um, so I wouldn't want that. Um, I would want to make sure that Tom just fitted into the cell nicely with no, with not a lot of extra space and um, however the picture still has the extra space but I could, uh, I could do it over again. I could copy Tom um, 
go to my new location, hold the shift key down while I click edit and paste picture. And now, now I do some rotating and um, Tom doesn't have all that extra space that I had before. So that's a little tidier. Uh, you probably don't want this extra space there. You can click any of the circles and drag the uh, image uh, smaller to the right or to the left or wherever, wherever you want it. You can drag down, but chances are it will get distorted if you only drag it in one direction and not, and not the other. Uh, you can also drag Tom anywhere. The computer doesn't care where you put it in a cell or halfway between the cells that it's just going to print out wherever you wherever you drag that image that's where it's going to end up um, so I would probably save this file file and uh, save as and um, I'll probably give it a name I think I I think I put it in um, somewhere it doesn't matter um, that's all right I'm not gonna I don't have to save it for here for now so just cancel that okay that's about the uh, that's about the uh, end of the uh, um, instruction so good luck on uh, rotating images and it's a it's a neat little trick and however if I forgot about how to do it I would have to go on Google and and type Excel rotating images and I think I could that's how I found it in the first place because I never did know how to do this